Exploring Karmic Debts, A Guide to Understanding Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an intriguing and thought-provoking topic in the English language, karmic debts. This phrase is rich in meaning and cultural significance, and understanding it can enrich your language skills and cultural awareness. Let's embark on this journey together. Karmic debts are a concept rooted in spiritual and philosophical traditions, particularly in Hinduism and Buddhism. The word, karma, comes from Sanskrit and means, action, or, deed. It refers to the idea that every action has consequences. Karmic debts, then, are the consequences of one's actions from the past, believed to affect one's current and future lives. This section will explore how these ancient beliefs intertwine with language and how they are used in modern English contexts. In English, karmic debts often takes on a metaphorical meaning. It's used to talk about moral or ethical consequences of one's actions, especially when those actions negatively impact others. This section will delve into examples of how this phrase is used in everyday conversation, literature, and media, demonstrating its versatility and depth in the English language. Understanding the cultural context of karmic debts is crucial. While it has roots in specific religious traditions, its usage in modern English often transcends religious connotations. We'll explore how this phrase is understood and used across different cultures and contexts, highlighting its universal themes of morality, responsibility, and the cyclical nature of actions and consequences. I hope this video has shed light on the fascinating concept of karmic debts and how it enriches the English language. Remember, language is not just about words and grammar. It's also about the ideas and cultures they represent. Keep exploring and expanding your understanding of English and see how it connects you to a wider world of ideas and experiences. Thanks for watching and stay curious.